I am very passionate about this topic, about how to create a positive environment at home. And the reason why is because I have done it. And I created a series of videos and I'm going to share some of my secrets with you. This video is for anyone that have their own place and it's especially for wives and moms. In this video, I'm going to teach you about how to have a positive environment at home. And I'm also going to share some of the benefits of having a positive environment. Recently, I have been receiving a lot of feedback about my home so within the last two years or so. And some of the things that people will tell me when they enter my home is that how warm it feels, how that it feels so comfortable and relaxing. And I even have had one of my babies that comes to visit me every other week. When she comes, she has said a couple of times how that I love coming to your house, Nana. And the reason why is because I feel at peace. And when she shared that with me, I just smiled within and it made me feel so good inside because that's one of the main things that I want people to feel when they come through my doors. Another compliment that I just got the other day from a lady that goes to my church. And she was saying that how that when she walked in the house, how that she felt the anointing. And when she said that, now I just smiled because I'm like, now no one have ever told me that. And so you guys, just those compliments motivated me to want to talk about this topic. And the reason why is because I knew that I have called onto something special and I want to share it with you and I want you to do the same for your home. In this video, I'm going to talk about your attitude. Now, your attitude has a lot to do with your environment at home. And believe it or not, you as a woman, you create the environment at home. One of the main things that will help you have a positive attitude, and that is spending time with God. I try to make sure that every morning when I wake up, that I take out some time and I spend time with God. I read my Bible and I meditate and think about what it's saying. Sometimes I even listen to soft music. Other times I journal and just by spending time with God, it just makes me feel at peace within myself. And when you have a peace within, it shows through your behavior, how the way that you respond to other people, how the way that you respond to your husband, if you're married or your children, if you are a mom. All of that is important. Do you know that when you are at peace, people around you, they will feel it and they will be at peace too. So your mood and also your attitude has a lot to do with your environment. When you are positive, the environment around you will be positive too. And it will cause you to act positive and to, to do positive things. Mostly throughout my home, I have little gadgets in each room that I can listen to music. Believe it or not, that music does change your environment. It changes your mood. I mean, think about it. When you're listening to a sad song, a lot of times you're going to think about sad things that happen to you and you may even cry. But if you listen to music with happy words and with a good little beat to it, it's going to make you feel preppy and it's going to pick you up. One of the main things that helps me to feel positive all the time, and that is having a grateful attitude. I can honestly say that I have been through things in my life that was very difficult. For example, when I lost my mom, one of the most hardest things that I ever went through, but even though um, it was sad, and I'm still heartbroken by it, but I found something positive out of that situation. The positive thing is that I was able to spend time with my family, to spend time with my nieces and then with my nephews that I barely ever get a chance to see because we live so far away from each other. I want to encourage you to have a grateful attitude. And do you know that even that God appreciates it when we are thankful for what we have? 
And I can say this, it's like, home is my palace. My home is where I spend 85% of the time. So it's very important to me to be able to walk into my home and feel at peace, to feel at rest. My home is where I get rejuvenated. It brings me spiritual healing and the healing that I receive, it comes from God. I love hearing from you guys. If it was anything that I said in this video and it touched your heart, make sure you share it with me. I have a question for you. Do you purposely create a positive environment at home? If you like my message and you want to support me, all you have to do is just subscribe to my channel and also click on the notification bell. That way, whenever I upload a video, you will be notified. If there is a particular topic that you want me to talk more about, or if it's something personal that you want to ask me, you can email me at chatswithflow at gmail.com. Thank you for joining me. Bye.